be aware of this type of scam i lost 1500 euros hello guys welcome back to my channel i'm shramana das and i make videos about higher education in abroad lifestyle in germany and much more so in today's video i'm actually going to share my story like what happened to me in my last apartment and i think this is not uh, only common to me it happens to a lot of people and as a student we need to be aware about it and this things happen due to the scarcity of accommodation uh, everybody knows that the people who are coming from abroad they are in desperation of uh, you know of house of apartments so yeah so without any further ado let's start this video so in 2021 i took my first apartment private apartment uh, which is like just a one room there were two rooms one room is shared by one german man and the other room was shared by me and i took it in real uh, because of the family reunion visa and the person is like quite young and he was very sweet to me and uh, i was in desperate need at that time uh, so i took that home that room it was of 800 euros and uh, maybe i can show a picture if i have the room is very very basic it have maximum of these appliances are actually not working properly it doesn't have a proper light the furnitures were not that good but he doesn't tell me about all this i was like okay and i went to india and i came on april uh first the bed was not that good i told him he replaced me with a different bad bed on june and the dishwasher was not working and the other guy the german guy who is staying he was on social benefit he used to have parties every day a lot of time the police came i was so much disturbed like i think on that six month duration i was never happy i always used to complain to the owner i i think a lot of times i complained to police about it uh, so i was not happy but i think he was not too much bothered at least he yeah like he he was not bothered he used to tell me, oh shraman i'm so sorry this and that but he doesn't have that much responsibility to fix it out now in august i left that apartment i cleaned it as much as possible i showed him sent him the video and he was said yeah okay i will send you the deposit in you know 15 there was nothing i cleaned i sent him the video and everything on october 15 he messaged me that you know i saw a bed bug in your room and i and he sent me the bill that you know 800 euros has been deducted for this i have to do this and that and I will keep your rest of the amount for more six months for heating i was like why when i went there was no bed bug if there was a bed bug i would have known i stayed there for so many and i so told him show me the proof and he's like okay this is the proof and this is the proof he showed me actually does it show any ways that it's a bed bug it can be any insects like when he gave me the room it was not even properly clean and my mistake was i have not taken any legal insurance for that i was like like i actually contacted to legal advisors um, of tum and they said that you know it's you cannot prove them because he has a bill and how can i prove now that you know you have a bed bug or not but i'm totally sure that you because just think logically if i have a bed bug i cannot stay there for six months and he when i showed him the video that you know i sent you this video after cleaning the apartment why didn't you tell me that time or when you were cleaning this apartment or when you called this bug people to clean the bug why didn't you tell me that time when why after two three months you were just coming up with a bill he has no answers but you know I, I cannot do anything because i already is having he's already having my 1500 euros and now he's telling that he will keep more money the rest of the money for six months because of the heating now from april to august the heating is off so for what the heating he will take i don't know but no but you know he's very clear you know his intentions are very clear that he's not going to give my money back so i think it's just a wastage of time because i don't have a legal insurance at that time so i cannot fight against him but i think this is so bad it is such and i also think it is such an audacity i am so suffered in your place staying with the, that german guy he used to have parties he was not cleaning his kitchen nothing and then you have that audacity to 
keep my deposit back and I always used to give the rent in time and everything. He had also written a good, you know, recommendation for from as an owner. But yeah, this is how I'm not saying that every landlord is like this. But this is what my experience is and I also saw a lot of posts in Facebook regarding this. So I think guys if you are coming to Germany, please take a liability insurance, please take a legal insurance because uh, there are so many people who are taking this kind of advantages and I just want to share my story here. So yeah, that's all guys. Let me know in the comment section what do you think about this and yeah, bye bye. Stay happy, stay blessed.